what's good youtube it's me bionic and today i'm bringing you more news on paranormal cleanup so at the minute i am currently helping beta test uh patch 0.0.5 um so i kind of just wanted to go over a few things we're going to be looking out for show you some footage because this time i did the smart thing i went i played it i recorded it and i'll show you some little highlights for that at the end of this video but for this patch <clears throat> we are getting more ai changes it's going to be a little bit harder less buggy i don't know i kind of been, came across a couple of bugs on my couple of playthroughs but it happens hopefully they'll be patched before this patch comes out to the public um we have game game pad control settings uh closet tweaks um destructible windows ai checks closets the garage can be opened uh ai c player lose player has been improved now <clears throat> in terms of the ai c player and lose player i don't know if that's going to be a little bit different for say multiplayer i've only tested in single player so far and i don't know i kind of feel other than when she despawns and you have that little bit of a gap where you can run around and do what you have to do again i kind of felt like she'd backtracked a little bit and gone back to the camping stage but it might have just been my poor luck garage door my god the simplicity of that opening oh, i actually used it a few times during my first playthrough like once she locks the door it just gives you another out at the front of the house however i kind of i don't it didn't happen for me she hasn't killed the power but if she kills the power i'd like to see the garage door go down so i don't know if that's what happens yet if not i would like to see that implemented because if that stays open you got the key locking the front door now is really not an inconvenience at all um ai checking the closets i haven't had that but i don't know how prominent that would be in single play because if you're by yourself and she comes to the colors and opens it you're not going to have a good time at all um destructible windows that is a fun one where do i even begin on that um it adds a little jump factor because when you're you could be downstairs you hear the push upstairs okay cool you got more sounds but when you're running past like um in one of the videos i'll show at the end i'm running down the side of the house trying to get to the front and boom a window shatters over the top of me and i was like Shh. it actually had a little bit of jump factor um which is really cool then i was like wait a minute can we break them so i went back into another game picked up a bag you can smash windows by throwing bags at them okay which gives me big brain thoughts it's like you let's have a look at here let's follow my mouse you got those two windows upstairs what if you smash them if the ghost is coming for you and once they bring jump into the game can you jump out the window onto this bit of the roof and then jump back in like would she be able to get out onto the roof are we going to be able to get on the roof like I feel like that would be a whole nother aspect really because if you look at the basic floor plan who's to say we can't jump out of one of these windows jump up here jump up here walk over the roof and boom that's another way in the attic for those who are struggling to find keys and need to get up there is that a way we can do it i don't know we will soon see um closet tweaks i if anything i found the closet to be buggier in my couple of playthroughs than during the last patch it might just be sheer bad luck for me but at the minute i'll obviously be doing a few more playthroughs tonight because we've got about at the time of recording this i probably have about nine hours left access to the beta um yeah we'll see if that gets tweaked anymore i'm definitely glad they're increasing the hardness though i think i died once instead of my usual no death and that was probably because she was camping um actually backtracking the closets i really want to see when you come out of the closet how if you don't move you're invulnerable i'd like to see that patched otherwise that's good that makes it too easy coming out of the closet and being able to stand there going right she's going she's going and she's gone and then you're away like we, that needs to go that definitely needs to go but the game is definitely heading in the right direction 
Um, so yeah, as I was saying, that is the current patch that is coming. Should be coming tomorrow. If he sticks to the usual time, it will be about 3 p.m. Australian Eastern Standard. I'm not sure where that, what that is for the rest of the world, but yeah. So let's take a look now at some of the footage from 0.0.5. And as always, if this video, if you've enjoyed this video, leave a like, comment, subscribe if you haven't. And yeah, stay tuned for more paranormal cleanup content. Until next time, YouTube, catch.